subscribe my video so in today's video what i'm going to be doing is um i made brick border as you can see wait let me just showcase let me showcase the borders i made in bricks so yeah right here we have india china russia next we have south africa here and brazil here all right b for brazil s for south africa b r k i for india okay c for china and r for russia okay that that's bricks and i also uh, made did something else you know as for the bonus part um i kind of have 10 aircraft carrier strike groups that have let me that have okay uh, how do you say yeah um, yeah one aircraft carrier two battleships that act as cruisers four destroyers and four submarines all right right here this is my economic zone that's why so many factories uh, around here and that's why it's so heavily protected okay we have three carrier strike groups here 5k tanks okay 5000 tanks and 50 no i mean 5500 okay you know what just 500k 500k infantry and then we have two more strike groups here all right two more strike groups here near mumbai and chennai i think no kolkata more strike groups here because i also tried to be as realistic as possible okay with my navy right here it's a smart move to keep a carrier strike group near your largest cities these are just four of my one two three four five okay no that's five of my carrier strike groups if you move on to china and russia we have another stri carrier strike group here so that invaders can not, not pass easily to here this part and another carrier strike group here near shanghai it's a very populous city and another strike group here to block to defend this entire line okay from here to here because that's an access point to beijing and we have some destroyers on patrol here just casually patrolling the water and if we move on to brazil i actually only have like one carrier strike group i think what what's this okay i no 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 wait yeah that uh, one carrier strike group and we have another carrier strike group but i accidentally messed something up oh no wait i just sent in the this i just sent the destroy the submarines there i didn't send i didn't send the no wait those are the destroyers right yeah so my submarines and my and battleship and uh, the carrier itself are here let me fix that mistake real quick and right here we have let's see 1 million infantry in brazil all highly trained you know brazil is so far from me but you know so it would make sense to keep at least 1 million soldiers there since it's very far let me just give me a minute uh, okay problem solved i think problem solved yeah we'll move on to that later why is the submarine not moving the submarines are not moving move this is very this is so annoying right now yeah anyways fix my mistake while that's happening i'd like you to showcase south africa i'd like to showcase south africa i here i have one carrier strike group here and and you know i surrounded it south africa with destroyers just patrolling you know and then i told you guys that i tried to make things as realistic as possible so here in somalia i put a bunch of destroyers and submarines because you know somalia has a lot of pirates irl and i wanted to decrease the crime rate even though this is just a game and i was 
I try to make things as realistic as possible. So yeah, I put you know uh, some destroyers and submarines to escort cargo ships and uh, capture any pilots they find. And yeah, that's that's my navy. And if you look here, I have like two trillion USD, two trillion dollars. Yeah, that's a lot. I know. And if you look at my army mainly, I have 139 warships, alright? 139 warships. There you go, I have a carrier strike group protecting Sao Paulo. Why, why are these two cities so hard to pronounce? I can pronounce this. Rio de Janeiro, that's easier, but Sao Paulo, Paulo, whatever it is. So yeah, my another strike carrier strike group is protecting these two major cities. So um, yeah, let's just move forward. So yeah, that's it for today's video. And this these borders are 100% bricks. You can see, see, I already told you that and showed you it. So yeah, anyways, hope you enjoyed my video and see you guys next time.